what are the items you would need when starting your own fashion brand or fashion business or basically you just want to make your own clothes at home stick around and watch this video till the very end hello boys and girls welcome back to my channel my name is pamela azemobo um in this video i'm going to be showing you guys some of the tools that you would do the fashion industry or learning how to make your own clothes or you probably want to even start up your own fashion brand so i'm just going to be showing you guys some of the essential tools that you would need when trying to start up or if you want to be making your own clothes at home here are some some of the items or some of the essential items that you would probably um, need share and uh, subscribe and let's keep this video going first and most essential item you would need is obviously your sewing machine many different types of sewing machine we have out there but if you are just starting out or you are just getting into the sewing business and you're trying or probably trying to learn i would always advise to go for the butterfly electrical sewing machine i have a number of this and um, i always recommend this especially if you're trying to um learn this um has um is actually very portable and easy as like easy you can easily carry it around and it has like different um functions and different um stitches there are a lot more this will be a, a different and a separate um video after this one on how to um, probably use the butterfly um, electrical sewing machine so this is the first and essential item you would need if you are going into the um, sewing business or trying to make clothes for yourself or you're even basically trying to learn there are different um, stitches that you can also um, learn with they have also have different foot that you can buy and use um, with this and um, you know this uses um, lights so that's why it's an electrical sewing machine the most essential um, tool you would need when you are starting off is very important i don't think you can sew without actually having a sewing machine the next on my list is the fabric scissors there are actually two um, types of scissors we have the paper scissors and the fabric scissors a lot of people actually don't know that there are two types there are different types of scissors but they're actually different type of scissors so this is the fabric scissors and this is the paper scissors there are two different types this is i use this for paper if you are into um pattern making and this is the fabric scissors and if you guys can see this so so this is a, your um your second most important tool when making your own clothes so you need the fabric scissors. You need the fabric scissors when cutting your fabric. Now, the third most important tool is your measuring tape. Um, I don't know how you so or make your own clothes without actually having a measuring tape. So there are the, um, different types of measuring tape, but this one is up to 60 inches. <clears throat> and at the back, we have 150 centimeters. Um, if you are trying to um if you are into pattern because when you're making patterns you have um we work with centimeters not inches but the one at the front you know is just normal um tailoring i think they have the one of 120 um inches i, I have two of those tape but i don't know i can't find the, the other one so this is um this is your measuring tape um this is your third most important tool or i would even say second most important tool in this case because you need this to take proper body measurements there are tools that comes with your butterfly sewing electrical machine this came with it and we have here we have some two um some bobbins some extra bobbins i'm going to just take this close different kinds of food we have oil to oil your machines we have the seam ripper we have like a brush so a brand new butterfly um electrical sewing machine this is always inside it so this is part of it now the next two or item you would need are your threads you need the different kinds of thread to be able to thread your machine um and probably um different colors so threads are also very um important next item you would need is your seam ripper the seam ripper comes looking like this this is what um it looks like 
the whole essence of having a sim ripper is just to correct mistake maybe you sold something that is not looking so good or you made a mistake back then we used to use blades but sometimes if you're not careful you know the blade can rip off the clothes so sim ripper is actually a good idea to um good to to have i have a number of this but for now this is the only one that i could my, i could get next item on my list are pins so these are uh, um they have different types of pins they even have clips but you know pins are cases where you actually need pins to work with so uh pins are very um, is a very important item you also need to get when also starting out um to help you know put your fabric in place when sewing so that you know you don't have like one side longer than the other so pins are actually very important and depending on the kind of fabric you are sewing i will always advise you to use pins when starting out next item on my list is taylor's chalk taylor's chalk is very good this is what i have that this is what this looks like back lines on your fabric to um mark proper measurements on your fabric so having a tailor chalk or having tailor chalks is very also an important tool to have the next item on my list is a calculator now this is not really important this is not um something that you must get um this basically is good for people that are into pattern making i am into pattern making and that's why i have a calculator because in most cases um my phone my phone is usually recording so i need a proper calculator to be able to calculate so this is just essential if you are into pattern making this item is iron this is the philip power life iron and um the whole essence of having an iron is basically to give your clothes a neater finishing. That's why I will always advise, you know, iron your clothes as you sew. It's very important. It makes your clothes look cleaner and look neater when sewing. So owning an iron is very important when sewing because from the moment you start cutting, I will always advise to iron. I have two of this iron. I have the other um, steaming iron, um, which is the bell ray um, um steam one so i normally use this when i'm dripping and if you cannot afford to have the two i always advise to go with having a normal iron which is this next item i have are needles having extra pair of needles are very important because when sewing your thread um your well, your needles can break needles when sewing um i right here i have two different type i have the electrical um, um ones that is the needles that i use for the electrical sewing machine and normal needles that i that is used by hand hand sewing needle because sometimes i prefer stitching my um buttons with my hand important items to have when budgeting and buying some of these tools different types of um sewing machines Currently, I'm using the two two lion industrial sewing machine. I would always advise to go with the butterfly um, electrical sewing machine because usually when you are just starting out, um, the two lion is more advanced. And if you are very good with your sewing or you catch up really fast, I would say you should buy that. The price ranges they are quite um, different when um, you know when buying them. Um, obviously, the two lion um, industrial sewing machine is more expensive than the butterfly electrical sewing machine um which each um item i'm going to try i'm going to leave the prices of how much i got the item on the screen or in my description box so that you can go check it out and you have an idea of the budget you are keeping when trying to get um this part uh, this particular um items some more items i could state here i'm just going to leave them in my description box please don't forget to like share and subscribe i will catch you guys in my next video